In this video, we'll show you how to access the different label and CSV exports in ParcelQuest. Keep in mind, the number of data exports available for free each month are based on your subscription type. Should you have questions about your subscription level, please give us a call. To demonstrate how to access the export menu, let's first run a search. Let's run a search for the last name of Williamson in Sacramento County. The results will display on the Google map as well as the list view below the map. At this point, let's go ahead and access the Label Export drop-down menu at the top of the screen. You'll notice that I have no export options listed here. Remember, this area is fully customizable in that you can choose which export options you'd like to display. Let's first add all of the Label Export options to the menu. To do this, we first need to click the Manage Items button. From here, you'll see all of the available labels exports listed on the left. Notice the selected labels exports box on the right side is empty. For our first demonstration, let's select all of the label exports. When finished, we'll need to click the close button in the upper right hand corner. Now, when we again access the label export menu, the label export options will be displayed. There are four available label exports. Citus address without the APN included, Citus address with the APN included, mailing address without the APN included, and last but not least, mailing address with the APN included. It's important to remember that each selected parcel in the list view will be included in the export. If there are parcels currently listed in the list view that you do not want to include in the final export, Simply deselect the parcels that you want to exclude. Next, choose the label export that you'd like to download, followed by the Generate button. In Google Chrome, the label export PDF download is located in the bottom left of the screen. To display your labels, simply click on the recently downloaded file. Each label file is exported as a PDF and can be printed on Avery Label 5160. Next, let's move on to CSV exports. With these exports, you can view your results in Microsoft Excel or any other compatible program. We'll need to repeat the same steps of adding each of the available CSV exports to the list of the selected labels exports by clicking on each one of them and adding them to the list. Each of the different CSV exports is now listed in the My Labels Exports menu. There are five different CSV exports to choose from. CSV address, CSV address values, CSV address values characteristics, CSV default tax, and CSV list view. For more information about the different types of CSV exports, please refer to page 24 in the full user guide that can be accessed from the support menu. To demonstrate, let's go ahead and select CSV address and click Generate. The CSV export file is located below and can easily be opened in Microsoft Excel. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.